Okay, we're now going to look at the video on fractions of shapes. Uh, so these questions are usually, there's two different ways you normally get asked a question. One is they give you a shape, like so, and they've shaded in some of it, and you've been asked to work out what fraction of the shape is shaded. Or another type of question is where they give you a shape, and you've got to shade in a certain fraction of it. So let's have a look at the uh, type where you've got to work out the fraction first of all. So the question says, what fraction of this shape is shaded? Give your answer in its simplest form. So you've got two things to do there. One is to write the fraction, and the second thing then is it's in to cancel it down. So, and watch the video on simplifying fractions if you need to know how to do that. So let's look at the triangle. So all together there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 different triangles inside of the big triangle. So because there's 9 little triangles, you put 9 on the denominator. And there's 1, 2, 3 that have been shaded. So it's 3 out of the 9. Now we want to now cancel this down. So you've got 3 ninths. Well, divide the top, you can see both of these are divisible by 3. So if you divide the top number by 3, you get 1. And if you divide the bottom number by 3, you get 3. So 3 ninths cancels down to 1 third. So 1 third of the shape is shaded in. Okay, so the next type of question is where you've got to shade in a certain fraction of a shape. So here's the question, it says shade in 2 thirds of the shape. Now the way you can do this, you can, you can shade in 2 out of every 3 triangles. So if you look at it, you could do... Shade, shade, not shade, 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 not shade. And then you would shade in two thirds of it. So if you would shade in four altogether, then you'd be shading in four, uh, two thirds of the shape. Another way of doing it, so that's probably a nice way of doing it if there's like this one, not too many um, little triangles inside of the shape. Another way to do it though is to do two thirds of it. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six little triangles altogether. So if you do two thirds of six, two thirds of six, so six divided by three, divided by the bottom times by the top, six divided by three equals two, and two times the top two equals four. So you have to shade in four of them, which we've done already, okay? These questions are usually quite simple, so you can just usually just shade in like that, two out of every three. Okay, and finally, we've been asked to shade in a half of this shape. So again, you could say shade one out of every two. So you could do shade, not shade, shade, not shade, shade, not shade, shade, not shade. That's going to be quite fun today. Um, or you could do it the other way, which is you count up all together. So there's uh, so many uh, little triangles are all together. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So it's going to be 18. Uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So it's 18 all together. And then you want to shade in a half. So you do a half of 18. And a half of 18 is 9. So you could shade in 9. So you could do shade, shade, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then that would be a half of it. Or you could do a half off the shape, or you know, there's lots of ways to do these questions. You know, some people would say, oh, okay, we could just shade in a half of it like this, and then shade in, you know, half of the shape. Um, or shade, not shade, so on. But they're quite straightforward.